A C B A. Yes, sir. We're officially back at it, Book Nice coming back at you with another quick update. This is a variant to the shot that I put up yesterday. The video that I put up yesterday pretty much kept the same set, swapped out Deadpool and Negasonic Teenage Warhead for a little makeshift red skull and crossbones. I just recently got this crossbones and just opened him. Shout out to the homies at the Collector Cave here in the Bronx. I'm actually still trying to complete the uh, Crimson Dynamo build a figure I'm so far behind on a lot of waves and a lot of builder figures not really a lot maybe like three I guess but I actually really like this crossbones I know there's been a lot of uh, talk about the head and neck and how it looks kind of awkward I've seen some kit bashes and some customs uh, that look really good but overall I think the figures okay uh, the silver guns I wasn't really a fan of I swapped them out for something black because the black guns that he did come with I don't think they can fit in the holster I didn't even try I just automatically swapped them out and then I'm utilizing a suited body from the movie Logan that came with the Professor X in the wheelchair and the two pack. I think this looks good for Red Skull, who is kind of buff. You know, he does have some super strength. So for a casual sort of suited Red Skull, I think this looks pretty good. There is some gappage towards the back of the head. The head and neck don't really connect as well as they should, but you know, you could finesse it. Uh, the idea here was that uh, Red Skull and Crossbones were overseeing a shipment of some weaponry and I got them kind of fingering some <laughs> fingering some um, shells here. I wanted it to appear that they were like some cape killer, high powered, armored, piercing rounds or something like that. And Red Skull's just kind of like, yes. <laughs> and I got a couple Hydra guys here just for some extras, a few little details. You can see a little hammer in the hand of the Hydra going on the right. So he could use that to pry open these boxes. And I'm liking the way this is looking. A couple of bright lights on the uh, left and right. I got those pointed down because I don't want it to be too bright on the black backdrop, but that's just a black piece of felt. And I got a couple of lights here in the front. This is pretty well lit, but I have the ISO pretty low. And then I'm just uh, doing a little rim light and with a colored light. So pretty contained, shooting 1-1. One, one. So I don't have to really mess with it as far as the framing goes. This will go right onto Instagram with no issues. And now that we know that we're gonna definitely be getting a new MODOK and the Scientist Supreme, you're gonna see a lot of people trying to bolster their aim agent army but uh yeah i'm just still working with hydra here i probably want to get maybe a few more of these hydra guys and uh maybe i want to get like five more aim soldiers so i'll have 20 i think i gotta go check and see exactly how many i have and then with the scientist supreme on top of that that'll be really cool and then mode up will be the, the cherry on top the icing on the cake but yeah i'm digging the way this came out just staying busy staying motivated putting up good quality content and keeping my foot on the neck of anybody putting up videos on youtube i'm always trying to outdo everybody else for sure so if you appreciate the quality and the stuff that i'm doing to smash that like button share comment subscribe thanks for hanging out hit that bell down there and until next time peace as far as i'm hearing y'all doing a lot of comparing let me get this one clearance like a sample kiss be the champ and i know that you don't want to get stamped left somewhere cramped so when it rain you get damp niggas is done since poppy raised the sum we get it in drums and slide old z's the bum